So your camera screen just starts randomly turning off. It's weird though, because sometimes it's fixed and other times it's not. It's just automatically doing random stuff. <sighs> But what was happening there was the actual viewfinder. So there's a little sensor at the top of the viewfinder here. And that triggers when an object, supposed to be obviously your eye, when it comes up to the viewfinder, it activates switching from screen to the viewfinder. Um, so what we've just done is turned off that automatic switching or activation mode just to manually set it to screen only. So this particularly caused an issue in my life when uh, I was using a gimbal and uh, the axis of the gimbal were moving in different directions and triggering in front of that viewfinder sensor, my screen would just be gone and it would just be the most frustrating thing in the world because you know, you wouldn't know if your shot's in focus, you wouldn't know anything, you're flying blind. So um, whenever you're shooting with a gimbal or doing any sort of fancy camera movements, go to that setting, switch it to screen only. Another situation I found happening was whenever you got a camera strap on your camera, if you're doing different handheld movements and you've kind of got the strap flying down like this, it's gonna start activating this, this issue all over again. Here's how we fix it. Head straight to the menu settings of your camera, take a right turn and head for the yellow tab with the spanner icon. Scroll down to page four. On page four, go to the display settings. In display settings, select display control and make sure you switch that to manual. Then in manual display, select screen. Boom. That's it, you're all fixed now. If you have preset camera settings, so that would be the C functions, so the, the custom setting modes, that's a great place to also reset those to screen only because you can, um, if you go back to those custom setting modes and they've already been preset to the auto switch from screen to viewfinder, you might find yourself with this problem again when you're relying on a custom setting. So just redo your customs as well, update them, and you will never deal with this problem again. Hope you found this helpful, guys. Let me know in the comments below if I've answered your question. If you have any more, I'd love to help you out. Thanks for watching.